And the Belarus state government is to map out a policy to promote teaching and learning of science and technology in schools across the state. Governor Hyacinth Alia gave the indication at the official opening of a science and technology school in Makodi, the state capital. Now, the governor, who was represented by his private Principal Private Secretary Dr. Emmanuel Chenge said the present challenges in the country deserve creativity and technical ingenuity from citizens to overcome them. With you in this technical education, that the private schools get to a level that the graduates of that school can fit into your school successfully. This country cannot develop. This country cannot progress unless we change our orientation. We should prepare our people to focus on production, to focus on using their God-given talents. This is not just school. It is a school that is being set up to address the issues that can solve some of our nagging problems being it on employment, insecurity, food insecurity, and ignorance. What we are seeing today is the beginning of the, the definition of formal education in this part of the country. This place is going to be a reference point. We are not just here in the school depending on theory. It's about practice. We want our students, as you can see, we want our students, we have our main items. We want our students to be able to create. We want our students to be able to innovate. It's not just about, you know, learning in the four walls of a classroom, but applying those skills to the challenges of life. And that is what we hold dear. Most of the students come out of the university. Straight with us when they started. They don't have any a student leaves this school after six years. That child may be able to start something of his own. And that is why we're training them in different fields. Of course, it's science and technology. Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.